Meerkat Mail by Emily Gravett. Sonny Meerkat lives in the desert with his family. He likes beetles on toast with insect larva, daydreaming and digging holes. Sunny lives in the Kalahari Desert. It is a very dry and very hot. Sometimes Sunny thinks it is too hot. Sunny comes from a large family. They work together, play together, eat together, learn together and sleep together. In fact, they do everything together. They are very close. Sometimes Sunny thinks they are too close. Sometimes Sonny wishes that he could live somewhere else, so he packs his suitcase and writes his family a note. Dear everyone, I'm off to find somewhere perfect to live. Don't worry mum, I'll be staying without my mongoose relatives, so we'll be quite safe. Love from Sonny. P.S. I promise to write. On Monday, Sonny visits his Uncle Bob. To Mum and Dad, it's a lot like being at home here, except that I am the biggest. Hooray! The weather is sunny and the food is fantastic. Lots of scorpions, yum! Best thing is, no one has to keep lookout because there's this bird which goes squawk when there is danger. I told Uncle Bob our family motto is stay safe, stay together. He told me theirs is run and hide from Sonny. Uncle Bob's family make him feel very welcome, but Sonny just doesn't fit in. So on Tuesday... Sonny goes to stay with his cousins Scratch and Mitch and the rest of their family. Dear Mum and Dad, we have been living in an old termite mound, but we are moving. There is plenty of plenty to eat. Yours ticklishly, Sonny. Sonny is getting itchy feet. He decides it's time to move on. On Wednesday, he arrives at his cousin Edward's. Dear Mum and Dad, Grandad and Grandma, I'm staying on a farm. Ed's favourite food is chicken. I haven't tried it yet, but I've had plenty of eggs. Love from Sonny. Sonny is not at all sure that eggs totally agree with him. On Thursday, he heads off to stay with his cousins, Mildred and Frank. Dear Mum, Dad and everyone, it is raining quite hard. Hope the weather is better at home. Loads of love from Rainy. P.S. Great Aunt Maureen was right. I should have packed an umbrella. Sonny hates getting wet, so he decides to leave. By Friday evening, Sonny has reached Madagascar. Dear all, Arrived at Auntie Bea's and Uncle Rob's. It is very late and very dark. I think it may be past my bedtime. 
Aunt B and Uncle Rob don't seem to notice. I am leaving as soon as it gets light. Yawns. Faithfully, wish you were here, Sonny. Sonny is afraid of the dark. He can't think of anything worse. Until, on Saturday, he arrives at Great Aunt Flo's. Dearest family, Great Aunt Flo lives on her own. In a marsh! It is dark and wet. The food is disgusting. Slimy. And I am lonely, cold and tired. I really, really, really wish you were here. Or that I was not. All my love, kisses and snuggles, Sonny. Sonny is beginning to worry that nowhere is right for him. But then on Sunday, Sonny arrives somewhere very dry and very hot where everyone is very close. I'm home! And it is... Perfect. Stay together. Stay safe. I think.